In this tutorial, we're going to be discussing how to use the bind tool, which is um, useful if you want to create a more complex kind of bone. Let's create a new flash file, action script 3.0, and discuss how it works and what it's for. So create a regular shape, and you don't have to convert this to a symbol. We're not going to. And get the bone tool, and you can put bones in, more, in the same shape as many times as you want, so we're going to make that into a kind of five ways and if we would get our bind tool and then click on the bones if you were to look before we click you see these little rectangles right here these little squares representing the bone they're attached to so if we were to click this one or this one you'd see these like be these be highlighted and these are highlighted if you were to um see the yellow ones are what represent this bone, the bone that you're clicking, and you can tell it's selected by this little line right here. So all these points represent this bone right here. Let's say that if we had this bone or this one, and we want whenever this bone moved, it's gonna move this one because this bone also uses these two points, so this is automatically gonna move. But let's say that we wanted this one right here to move and this one right here to move when this one moves when this little corner moves so what you would do is click and drag that all the way to corner you like do the same here or you can just connect to the bone whatever you like now if we were to move this you'd see that we're starting to move a little more differently now same goes here and this makes it very hard to use the bone the bind tools are very hard to use as you can see even I have difficulties with it and the reason that you might want to use this let's say that you had a muscle and if you were to move this one up you'd want a muscle to pop up right here and I don't know how to do that exactly it's kind of hard for me to do but you can mess around with that and learn how to use it yourself and that's it for the bind tool there's no options for it until you use it and actually no there's no options for it it's just a bind tool and just connects bones together and that's it for the bind tool thanks for watching